Mm. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, man, get up on in here, man. Get up on in here, man. Oh, we finna put down some good game, homie. You see, you have to learn how to applaud yourself because if you're looking for appreciation from individuals, uh, what I will tell you is that is completely conditional. So that's what we'll be speaking about specifically on this episode. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, nah, man. So shout out to everybody in the building. Uh, whoever joined, join. Whoever don't, don't. But we finna put some good game down on the ground, man. I know we finna have some moderators joining, some subscribers, uh, some keys. Uh, we're gonna have an abundance. Matter of fact, we're gonna have a plethora of many different individuals joining. So with that being said, shout out to everybody, homie. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, homie, it's a brand new week. So you need to have a new mentality, new New energy coming in. You see, hey man, that's what we finna do, homie. Um, you need to understand that, man. You can personalize your experience when it comes to what you deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. But a lot of people, man, they just tolerate, and that's the reason why they ain't got nothing. And here it is, Keisha's trying to write comments. It ain't gonna get through. And even if it do, I got moderators in the building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can try to play, but I guarantee you that you won't stay. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, you can try to play, but I guarantee that you won't stay. If you sit around and you're trying to put out and project negativity at four o'clock in the morning, that just goes to tell me that you ain't got nothing to do. You ain't got no responsibilities. You ain't got no accountability. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You ain't got nothing to do. And that's the reason why you could continue to waste time because you ain't making no money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't nobody with dreams, ambitions, goals and the pursuit or whatever they want to accomplish sitting around on uh, TikTok as a man at four o'clock in the morning trying to put out negativity. The ladies never complain. So that's the reason why I sit back and I say what I say. So anyways, man, shout out to everybody in the building. Uh, make sure you go ahead and start liking the stream because if you don't like me, I don't like you. And if you don't like me, what you're watching for? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. If you don't like me, what you're watching for? Yeah, yeah. I obviously captivated you either by the way of appearance or the way of my vernacular, my vocabulary, homie. Yeah, yeah. That's the way it go. So I'm sitting back, sipping on water, finna put down some good game. We're going to be talking about self-applauding, homie, because a lot of y'all are waiting on somebody else to clap for you, homie. You need to clap for yourself. Yeah, yeah. Each and every single day we go through certain battles where it's like you overcome certain things that you don't want to do anymore and you start doing things that you do want to do. So with that being said, man, uh, you get demotivated a lot of the times because somebody don't tell you good job. And that's the reason why you need to work on the relationship with yourself because you shouldn't need nobody to tell you good job, homie. Mm hmm. And shout out to Caleb coming through with the lives. I appreciate it, my guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to you for sending what you're sending. Uh, we having a great day, homie. Yeah, some of y'all might have used a weekend for absolutely nothing. Uh, some of y'all might have been productive this weekend. Whatever the case may be, homie, and guess what? Uh, it don't matter, but now it matter because guess what? We finna talk about what you need to do. Yeah, yeah, you might have wasted time, but there's no point worrying about the time you wasted because you can buy a watch, but you can't buy time. So we ain't going to sit back and trip on that. Uh, We're going to talk about the mentality that you need to have going into this week so you can optimize your experience because what you have to understand is how you end this year will be how you start the next one, homie. You can sit back and say, yeah, well, I'm going to do this next year. I'm going to do that next year. Homie, if you had the same mentality in December, it's going to be the same in January. It's just a lot of people like to delude themselves and sit around and lie to themselves. But it's like, homie, you can lie to people, but you can't lie to yourself. Yeah, 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 yeah. So with that being said, man, uh, here we go. Yeah, we finna do it in a nice way. Uh, shout out to everybody in the chat, man. We finna have a good conversation. Yeah, we finna talk about what we talk about, man. Yeah, real, man. I'm just putting down real game, quality game. Uh, get this person up out of here, man. You worried about how I came up with it. If you went and lived your life, you would understand. You see what I'm saying? People can come up with creative wisdom and game if they're really living life. But if you're sitting around and questioning, it's because you ain't even answered the questions that you have in yourself. Yeah, yeah, everybody always want to sit back and worry, how you do this, how you do that. Man, start doing what you do and quit worrying about what I got going on. Facts. And shout out to Caleb coming through with the heart me again. Yeah, I'm just preaching and teaching uh, all by the way of the most time, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't competing with nobody. I'm competing with the person who I was yesterday, man. And that's what a lot of y'all need to do because you get on social media and you see other people living quote unquote particular lives, homie. That in reality. That's a fantasy. So a lot of you are miserable because you chasing fantasies, homie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You idolize celebrities, even though they don't acknowledge you. I see so many people, like, for example, with the little Nas X situation. I see a lot of people in the comment section arguing, oh, he's this, he's that. But he don't know either of the ones arguing for or against him. So it's like, we got to stop stepping up to the front lines for people who wouldn't even let you get to the front of the line of that concert, homie. Yeah, 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 yeah. People's priorities is all over the place, man. They're interested in the wrong things and disinterested in the... Hey, Hey, man, and get that person about here. Yeah, yeah. Any guy sitting around at four o'clock in the morning calling another man that you don't know your uncle out of here. We're not doing that, man. 
Oh, that's not the way that you talk to other guys, homie. And I'm telling you right now that don't a single lady in this chat think it's cute when you call another man uncle because that's one step closer to calling me dad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and that's one step closer to calling me another name that's similar to that. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure you can assume. So with that being said, man, we're just sitting back uh, putting down good gold even though it's cold. Yeah, 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 we putting down good gold even though it's cold, man. The truth has been told, man. Yeah, we putting it down uh, in a way to where you can pick it up, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, man, it's fascinating. And everybody that tries to get me aggravated, it don't work, man. Because I'm giving you this truth. Yeah, some of this stuff is unreal. I'm just saying, man, the things that they do, the lengths that they go to, and the whiff that they are, man, uh, they don't even have the wherewithal. But guess what? They don't understand that they're paying me. Yeah, they're paying attention. So keep on paying me. Yeah, yeah, no refunds, uh, uh, no five-finger discounts, and none of that. Keep on paying me your attention, and I will use that as a source of energy. <laughs> yeah, 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 keep on doing it, man. They don't got no objectives. They don't have no aspirations. They're not consistent with anything. What it do, man? What's up, man? Yeah, shout out to everybody in the chat, man. Uh, we're just doing a little bit of rapping and capping, uh, putting down some good game. Wherever the spirit puts me is what I'm going to speak. Whatever I don't speak about, I don't. Whatever I do, I do, man. That's the thing, man. You never know what you're going to get when you get to my show. But one thing that you do know is when it comes to the tonality, it will be in the mood of real, man. Yeah, everything got to be real or I don't even want to deal. I'm like, sire, I keep them 100, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like uh, Ryan Garcia. I'm out here making great things happen. Uh, they mad at me because I'm glorifying God. And when you mad at somebody for glorifying God, that tell me who you glorify. Yeah, yeah. When you get mad at someone for um, supporting a positive influence, it tells me exactly the type of individual that you are. You know what I'm saying? So that's the reason why I sit back and I say, man, I don't trip. I'm glad when the Keishas let me know who they is because I already knew half the time uh, all you do is reaffirm what I already confirmed. It's called a screening process. It's like, yeah, you know, like way back in the day, uh, back when Madden had the rewind, you wanted to throw the halfback screen. Yeah, yeah, with Frank Gore, with Darren Sproles, and he was gone, man. That's the type of play that we be running out here. Uh, get that guy up out of here for asking me if I like a whole other man that we're not even talking about. We're not talking about, homie, why are you bringing up other men's names that don't even know of your existence, my guy? Do you like this guy? Do you like that guy? Do you think that's a conversation that you would really want to approach with me if you saw me in real life? You would ask me about another man? Are you finna go run and tell him, hey man, he likes you. Homie, I don't swing that way. I like the ladies. Now I know it's 2023. We got a lot of saucy Santanas out there, but I'm not with that energy. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Nah, I'm not interested, homie. I'm gonna have to pass on that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to Aaron Rodgers pass on that. And shout out to the homie that, well, whoever that is that just sent the rose. I ain't saying your username, homie. Yeah, 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 man. You got to have something better than that. But uh, yeah, man, make sure y'all keep double tapping the screen. And I would like to say, make sure each and every single one of you go ahead and uh, send me a message immediately on TikTok. Um, because after this episode ends relatively soon, I'll be sending everybody, my, get that person out here. I'll be sending everybody my Snapchat. That's the best way to talk to me. And knowing I'm going live, what's good? Oh, oh, I forgot how to say your name again. Tell me how to say your name again, girl. I done already forgot. What's good, Andre? Hey, Andre, homie. You've been consistent, homie, so I'm finna make you a moderator. I told you that. Uh, I told you that, man, so I'm finna make you a mod, you hear? But look, don't block nobody. If they do anything they're not supposed to, just mute them, my guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, only Keisha graduates get the block. So I just gave you the moderator role, man. Can you be a mod, too? I, uh, yeah, I want to see you around for like one or two more lives, and I'm going to give it to you. I like your energy anyways, but keep up the good work. What's up, man? What it do? Yeah, man, shout out to all my people in the chat, man. Matter of fact, let's get a quick roll call. Where's everybody from? That's another reason why the Keishas be mad, homie, because we worldwide. Don't nobody know them outside of their bathroom. So with that being said, man, where are all y'all from, homie? Let's get a quick roll call. I'm going to give a drum roll. And da -da 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 -da. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, we got Michigan in the building. Okay, okay, okay. Kansas City in the building. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, North Carolina in the building. Yeah, Philadelphia, Philly. Yeah, yeah, I'm an eagle. Washington, Missouri, the Golden State. Get that quiche out of here. You know what I'm saying? Look, man, that's the reason why they mad, man. So what I'm telling you right now is, homie, you should be happy when you know you post something and you don't get a lot of likes. You know why? The reason that everybody don't like it is because they mad at your success. When you post a picture of you at a luxurious spot and they don't like it, but they view it, homie, it's because they're envious. They're jealous, man. It don't cost a dime to show love. But guess what, man? They can't show you. They can't show you anything that they don't possess within themselves. They don't have love, homie. They got a lot of grief. They got a lot of sorrow. They mad at everybody else because, man, deep down, they mad at themselves, homie. Every fallout that they ever had in their life is always that person's fault. It's never their fault. These are the types of individuals that you want to steer clear away from, homie. 
Uh, uh, they have a victim mentality. Uh, they always want to say, well, man, it's because of this. It's because of that. Homie, when is it going to always stop being about someone else? And when is it going to be about you? Uh, homie, I know everybody likes talking about the classes that they pass, but sometimes we fail in life. And that's the reality. Positive. Uh, uh, I keep it real. Some demon is positive, some negative. But yeah. So look, man, um, we just putting down good game, man. We staying grounded, man. Some of y'all might have backslid last week and you might have got caught up talking to somebody that you don't need to be talking to. Maybe you put yourself around environments that you know ain't beneficial for you because it's never beneficial. What I'm going to tell you right now, homie, is look, understand that it is what it is, man. You can't go back, so you might as well go forward. Yeah, yeah, don't fall, don't fall behind, man. Fall forward, homie. It's cold outside, but you got to become comfortable with the cold, homie. Yeah, you got to become comfortable because guess what, man? Seasons change or so do people. But you got to remain the same because the truth of the matter is people don't necessarily change. They just finally show you who they were the whole time. You think that they change because you have this falsified uh, 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 perspective of them based upon what they were choosing to show you. But once you see what it is, man, hey, say, man, it is what it is. You got to have an it is an you got to have an it is what it is mentality. That's just the way you got to go, man. It's a cold world out here, my guy. And what's next? You got to be sitting around saying, man, what's next? Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't be expecting nothing because the minute that you expect, man, you're going to get surprised, man. Uh, 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 uh. So I sit back and I say, loyalty don't exist no more, man. Once people can't get money from you. Uh, once they can't get clout from you, once they can't get rides from you, uh, once they can't get whatever they were seeking, y'all don't even be speaking no more. Once they can't get whatever they were seeking, get that quiche out of here. Once they can't get for what uh, whatever they were seeking, y'all no longer speaking. How many of y'all sitting around and you stop calling particular individuals and y'all don't even talk anymore? It's because y'all were never meant to talk to begin with. They were just using you, man. One thing about the outlet, if you plug a charger into any outlet, it's going to give energy to that phone or that device. But guess what? Uh, that device is not loyal to that outlet because once it leaves, it's going to another outlet. That's how these people be, man. They're going to use you uh, for as long as they can use you. You know what I'm saying? Get that key ship out of here, man. You see what I'm saying? They ain't even got no good level of troll comments, homie. Y'all got to come up with some unique approaches. Uh, it will never be read out loud. I don't have text to speech. Uh, so you can keep wasting your time. But guess what, homie? I'm going to apply mine. You see what I'm saying? Man, you got to pat yourself on the back, homie, because a lot of people smile in your face all the while they want to take your place. They tell you that they're proud of you, but behind closed doors, they're angry. Oh, man, why you keep on winning? Why she keep on winning? A lot of you ladies get in a relationship and your homegirls say, oh, y'all so cute. But really, they behind the scenes. Oh, man, why she with him? Oh, 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 she need to do this. She need to do that. <laughs> That's why I tell ladies, man, when you in a relationship, you know what you know. But don't know what you know because somebody else told you. Because a lot of single individuals try to split up relationships because they don't want to feel left out. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. Get up out of here. But look, man, uh, make sure each and every single one of you go ahead and send me a message um, immediately on TikTok. Because once this episode ends, I'm going to send everybody my Snapchat, homie. Uh, that's the best way to talk to me and know when I'm going live. And man, shout out to my moderators. And say, Andre, I done made you a moderator, homie. I don't know if you're still in here, but if you is, you need to get on your business. I just gave you a moderator wrench, so that means you need to use it. Otherwise, what's the point of having a toolbox if you ain't going to use it? Yeah, yeah, I'll take it away and I'll give it to uh, the lady that I asked earlier, homie. I don't play no games, so when I reward you, you better show me why I rewarded you. Otherwise, <laughs> I'll unreward you. Yeah, well, yeah, that's the way that it go, man. And uh, get these two up out of here, man. I don't even like... Yeah, 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 I wasn't even talking to y'all, homie. You see... A lot of you be getting the wrong perspective as if I'm talking to you. I'm talking to y'all, homie. Yeah, 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 man. Quit thinking that a TV screen, a phone screen, uh, uh, whatever the case may be is talking to you. Homie, you ain't supposed to be sitting back thinking that the characters on the TV screen is talking to you. And to the person trying to go live with me, absolutely not, my guy. Uh, listen to me. I don't want to have no FaceTime with you at 4 o'clock in the morning, homie. The last thing you should want to do at this hour of the night is get up on here and look at me. Homie, I, I'd rather look at a lady. I don't want to look at you, my guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, man, come on, homie. What y'all got going on? Get that person up out of here for spelling R wrong. But yeah, man, uh, make sure each and every single one of you send me a message. Yeah, tell them, Jello. 
Tell them, Jello. <laughs> tell them again. Say it again. Tell them for the tell them for the twin and twin and twin. <laughs> well, look, though, man, make sure each and every single one of you send me a message. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, as soon as this episode's over, like I said, I'll be checking my message requests. And everybody who messages me, I will be sending my Snapchat. That is the best way to talk to me, know when I'm going live next, and to stay up to date with the content. So make sure you all do that. Now, I would like to turn the mic over to chat. Uh, yeah, that is sweet tea. You ain't lying, homie. Uh, uh, they wake up every day. They don't have no highlights. You see what I'm saying? They're searching for things that they can complain about. Oh, man, I can't stand this. I can't stand that. Yeah, we need to do this. We need it. You're not even included. You just want to be emotionally bothered by whatever is going wrong in life because Oh, no, no, no. Don't dare believe that there can be a positive experience for us in this world we're living in. Propaganda is put upon us to make us have certain outlooks on life so we don't do certain things and we do certain things. You cannot allow an emotional driven instrumental behind a video that could be altered or a picture that could be altered to determine your reality television they're just telling you a vision homie but you don't even see it and just because you see it hey man it might be deception so that's the reason why i sit back and i say i'm not gonna let somebody else tell me what to believe i stand on what i stand on homie advice on how to lead a ha hey lead a happy well this is what i'm gonna tell you homie sean listen to me homie every day ain't happy what's good leilani every day ain't happy more days often than not i don't want to do anything but that's the reason i keep on going you know what i'm saying uh depression is real homie uh, we all have emotions. So to try to downplay it and act like it don't exist, that ain't ideal. But understand that even when you don't necessarily feel up to par, you still got to perform. And when you are able to get further in life and take care of the people that matter the most, starting with yourself, that will provide you with moments of joy. Happiness is something that you will be endlessly chasing because there will always be another storm that comes through and sweeps you off your feet. And you don't know how you react to it until it takes place. So don't chase happiness, chase success, homie. Yeah, yeah, because the things that make you happy ain't always good for you. Uh, the things that make you happy going to accelerate your expiration date. So what I'm telling you right now is a lot of people make you happy, uh, 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 but you make them mad. So what you need to understand, man, is you got to curate your reality. Homie. You got a lot of power. The domino effect is real. Uh, uh, and get that person up out of here too, man. Shout out to the Keishas, uh, coming back on the multitude of accounts, uh, turning around with their cheerleading outfits on, like the Wildcats from High School Musical, uh, doing their gymnastics. I appreciate it. Keep on showing the ladies why guys are more interested in guys nowadays, which is the reason why they shouldn't even give you all the time of day or time of night. Because you already give me the time of night, so why would they want to give you the time of day? Making a second account as well. Oh, yeah, that's what they do, man. Yeah, domino effect. Get that key up out of here. Don't got no profile picture, uh, 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 but stay typing in my chat, writing comments. Yeah, yeah, we ain't even reading it. Just imagine investing that much energy into someone, writing out a whole sentence, just for them not even to read it. I would never waste my time doing that. And then to put your standards even lower to the point to where you make another account, buddy. Goodness gracious, man. You say we matching? Yeah, Taylor, we matching. What it do? What you got? You say we matching? Well, I don't know what you got on. I can't see your profile picture, but that's what's up. Yeah, man, shout out to all my ladies in the chat, homie. Real talk, man, because we got too many, you know, guys out here complaining about ladies nowadays. But the dudes that be complaining ain't even men. They boys. Oh, well, I'm grown. Well, homie, you can be well above the age of 18 and still be a kid mentally, financially, uh, 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 spiritually. So that's the reason why I sit back and I say, man, I don't complain because I don't deal with what y'all deal with because I have standards. So if somebody don't want to align with what I say, we just ain't talking. I ain't going to talk. I don't got to talk down on somebody specific to uplift myself. I'm not with that because scriptures say, man, you better remove the log out of your eye before you talk about somebody else. No, nah, man. Uh, a lot of y'all's backyards, you need to mow the grass, but you quick to talk about somebody's front porch. Man, don't be a hypocrite. God don't like it. Let me read some of these comments, though. Yeah, man, and make sure all of y'all send me a message on uh, TikTok, man, because I'm getting ready to end this episode soon, you feel me? And everybody that does, homie, I'm going to send my Snapchat, man. That's the best way to talk to me, know when I'm going live, uh, and to stay today with the content. I'm adding so many different layers, and, man, it's a process, but guess what, man? Over time, you're going to see more and more, like that Chris Brown song, a little more. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So let me read some of these comments, homie. Shout out to the child person for the roses. Oh, you talking about the split die? Yeah. Yeah, you can't really see it right now, but this side is blue. Everybody's liking this new look. 
Yeah, get that Keisha up out of here. Keep on making more accounts. You see, if that person right there, you can understand that they don't really look at themselves in high regard because they're going to the lowest of lows to make multiple accounts. Imagine the content that they watched. If they posted about it, they could put themselves in a situation of monetization to where they could actually have proceeds for the amount of energy that they're putting into this. But instead, they would rather get down on their knees and beg me, please, to speak to them. What they try to make it look like is you acknowledge them. But listen, if I never say your name, I don't acknowledge you, homie. So with that being said, keep going out of your way to get in my way. But one thing about it is, homie, uh, that relay when you're doing track and field, I got a real good hurdle game. So you can hop in my way, but I'm going to just hurdle and I'm going to look back like Tyreek Hill. Deuces. Yeah, yeah. Deuces, deuces, deuces. That's just the way it go, man. Say, man, hey, man, don't be mad at the game. The game is the game. If you don't like it, uh, uh, quit playing it. Yeah, don't be mad at the game. The game is the game. And if you don't like it, then why is you playing it, homie? If you don't like the game, then why is you playing it? I'm just being real, Kuda. I'm just being real and it's something that they can't deal with because it makes them feel a certain type of way. It's not what you said. It's how you said it. Homie, listen, man. Uh, I'm not going to sit back and uh, cater to what you want me to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, get that out of here. What's up, Lena? Yeah, shout out to all my people. Put, yeah, facts, man. Yeah. Yeah, no, nah, man. Uh, so that's the reason why I sit back and I say, I speak on what I speak on. And the only person that it makes feel a certain type of way is the person I'm talking about, is the types of people that I'm talking about. If I didn't say your name and you feel offended, what does that say about you? If I didn't say your name and you feel offended, what does that say about you? Ladies, everybody in the chat, gentlemen, get that person out of here. If I didn't say somebody's name and they get offended by the message, what does that mean? I want to see what the chat says. Everybody get, me, get that person out of here too for spelling Keisha wrong. That smile though. Oh, you, you like that smile? The shoe must fit. Martin, I'm just saying, homie. The shoe must fit. What everybody got to say? Chat, let me know. Everybody, I want to see different answers. If the message, they want attention, exactly. If the message is not about you, but you get offended. If the message was not delivered to you, but somehow you received it, what does that mean? I want to know, chat. Let me know. Yeah, what's up, Maria? Hey, say, man, let me know. Let me know, let me know, let me know, let me know. Get that person out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Your username is off the chain, homie. Yeah, no. Nah. Yeah, uh, you say, uh, that's what it is, yeah. Guilty, Snow. That's what I'm saying, man. So this is the reason why I sit back and I say, listen, when you're doing what you do, when you're just living your life and you're not trying to jeopardize anyone else's livelihood and you're not trying to put them down and they get mad at you, Homie, stop taking it personal. They're mad at themselves. Get that person out of here, homie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You getting too creativity with the glazing. You gotta go. Yeah, 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 man. What the? It's, hey, man, you can't make this up, man. If you wake up at four o'clock in the morning and you see my face and the first thing you think of is another man, homie, stop telling me that you're interested in this when really you just want the banana. You just want the hot dog. So with that being said, a lot of you guys need to come out because what y'all do is y'all sit back and say, yeah, man, the ladies these days, the ladies, the, man, they be doing this, they be doing that. But homie, look at what you do. You're on my live at four o'clock in the morning calling me by the name of another man, homie. Get that person out of here. Like imagine if you was with your girl and you doing the do and you scream my name. <laughs> what do you think she's going to do? How is she supposed to respect you if you don't even respect yourself? These guys, these guys' closets aren't even, I'm just laughing. These guys' closets, get them out of here. These guys' closets aren't even organized. You know what I'm saying? They don't take care of their shoes. You get inside of their car and you look at the floor, it looks like the best definition of a, a yard with the word, y'all know what I was going to say. So when I say, man, if I get in your car and I see all them crumbs all over the ground, -bum -bum. if I get in your car, that's a representation of you. How you carry yourself with one thing is how you carry yourself with another. And if you got some cleaning to do, well, it's time to clean up. We all got things to work on. And that person needs to work their way out of my chat. For real, though. You know what I'm saying? Love hearing you speak. Uh, I appreciate that. Get that. Get that guy out of here. Listen, ladies. Here it is. This dude sitting around at four o'clock in the morning. He on the toilet, pants to his ankles, and he texting on his phone. He's kind of funny. Ooh, come on, homie. These are the types of guys that's mad at Lil Nas X for saying he's with Christianity. But lo and behold, they be in a bubble bath with their legs up in the air. Call me by your name. 
Tell me you love me. That's what these guys be doing. I don't like Lil Nas X. But when you go to their search history, they was watching the video. Here it is, man. This is the reason why I say they say one thing and they go the... Get that person out of here. They say one thing. They say they're over here. But why do I see you over there? They say they're over here. But why do I see you over here? Hey, hey, that don't make no sense. Get that guy out of here. Out of here. Look at him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So this is the reason why I sit back and I say, man, say, man, amen. We got to look at what's going on, homie. Uh, These guys will buy a brand new PS5 before they replace their toothbrush that they've had for over two and a half years. They're like, well, I brush my teeth at least once a day. Once a day? You eat Cheetos, Takis, you drink Mountain Dew, you have a gallon of sweet tea every day, potato chips, and corn, and you don't brush your teeth more than once a day? You guys will get off of work, and you want to hop on, I'm going to play Call of Duty, but you haven't even taken a shower yet. You come home to your girl, and literally it looks like the can is having an afro because the amount of trash that is piled up you ain't ready to take that out but you're gonna take your playstation out sit down and act like you just got something going on these guys will go to mcdonald's complain about fast food but won't actually learn how to cook i expect a woman to cook okay i appreciate the women that can cook i like a woman that can cook they say the quickest way to a man heart is by his belly but at the same time you need to become self-sufficient because homie you ain't looking for a partner you're looking for a substitute mother when i grow up when I grow up, get that person out of here, homie. I didn't ask. So this is the reason why I sit back and I say, homie, I'm, an, I'm, an, I'm going to increase my value in whatever area I desire to. But at the same time, if you would like to be a part of my life, I mean, you got to compliment me. Yeah, yeah, because I had to work hard to earn this value. That's the reason why you look my way. Yeah, yeah, a lot of these quiches don't have any value. We wouldn't even notice it if this comment section was without you. So that's the reason when you know that it's like, homie, why are you even typing? I'm just building. But they don't understand because guess what, man? They're not meant to, homie. You can listen to me all night. I appreciate that. Look, man, I would like to give a quick interruption. Make sure all of you send me a message on TikTok. I'm getting ready to end this episode relatively soon. And everybody who does so, I'm going to send my Snapchat, homie. Uh, that's the best way to talk to me. Know when I'm going live next and to stay up to date with the content because I'm not content with my growth. I'm going to continue to go up, homie. Ava, you witness. We started from zero and we built all the way up to 10K. We finna be at 11 and shout out to my people. Man, these ladies be holding it down more than these dudes nowadays. The brothers say they support you till you start getting swoller than them. The brothers say they support you until you start getting popularity. The brothers say they support you until you start getting all the ladies. But these ladies hold it down. And then they want to sit back and say, yeah, man, I can never be friends with a girl because I've all... Homie, if you can't control yourself and you can't keep can't keep my in my pants, hey, my no. If you can't do that and you can't have a mature interaction with somebody, that's your fault. I don't know about y'all, but I can have a friendship with whoever I choose to have a friendship with, homie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, a lot of y'all ain't in tune with yourself, and that's the reason why it be sounding like them alarm clocks from way back in the day that have radios attached to them, and you got to uh, 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 just trying to hear that radio Disney. You know what I'm saying? So, homie, I don't even be tripping. I just let it be known what it is and what it ain't and what it can be and what it can't be. You know what I'm saying? As you should. Facts, homie. Like, I can't even... And, and I used to be a follower, so I know what it's like to follow, homie. I used to be a follower. I used to say these things too. I used to be the bitter guy that got his heart broken because I was insecure. So it was always her fault and it was never my fault. Yeah, man, these girls, homie, if I was being a better man, I would have been able to pick up and pay attention to the indicators because yes, ladies do be doing guys wrong, but they give you signs, homie. And a lot of times when a lady trip on you for small things, I'm gonna give y'all guys some game because y'all be getting emotional and that's what they test you for to see if you're gonna let that quiche out. Like a lot of y'all do in my comment section. When your girl complains about something small, you're sitting there thinking, man, what's she tripping about this? There's, it, it's the action. So if you said you're going to do the dishes, right? And you don't do the dishes. You think she's tripping over the dishes. She's really tripping over the fact that you don't keep your word. And if you can't keep your word with the small things, and it's like, okay, I understand mistakes. But if you do this over time, it's a pattern. And people don't change. They just become better at hiding things, homie.
So that's the reason why I sit back and I say to myself, y'all don't know how to troubleshoot the issue because the issue is you, soldier boy. But that's the reason why y'all mad at me. <laughs> I didn't say I wanted to be accepted. I didn't say I wanted to be supported. Homie, I just come on here all in the name of being heard. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. If you like me one day, if you don't like me tomorrow, what's next? Because I love myself, so I don't need nobody else to, homie. Uh, Jesus was perfect, and they were still mad at him. So what makes me greater? Nothing. Yeah, yeah, I'm no greater than nobody. I'm just trying to be better than I was yesterday. But at the same time, man, there's a lot of anonymous profiles that speak so loudly, but I still can't hear them. And I say, man, silence is the loudest sound I ever heard, homie. It always told me the truth and how I need to move with certain people in my life. Yeah, 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 yeah. So everybody double tap that screen. I'm finna read some of these comments. I know we got a lot. What it say, man? Let's read some of these comments, man. As you should. Yeah, for sure. What's good, my guy, 40? Yeah, yeah. You see, 40 out here in real life, really going around, taking pictures of your favorite artists, really having conversations with them, really being out there, not in the comment section. Yeah, I know every song on the Little Uzi, or Al Uzi, Little Uzi Vert album. Have you ever met Little Uzi? No. Homie, then why are you worshiping him? Are you making any money off of knowing Lil uh, uh, supporting Little Uzi? No, but he really touched my soul. What? So this is the reason why I sit back and I say parasocial relationships are getting out of control via the internet, homie. The internet is the internet. What you going to do in real life? Get the resources, get the information, and apply the game because game applied means elevation, homie. Game applied means elevation. Remember what I said. Let me read some of these comments though, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nah, man. Everybody keep double tapping the screen, man. Let's get them likes up, homie. Say, shout out to uh, everybody following. Me too. Yeah, yeah. This, a hundred. Yes, sir. Let them cook. Yeah, I'm cooking. How do you love yourself? Can you? I didn't mean to invite you. If you join my live, I'm gonna get you out immediately, homie. I didn't mean to invite you. Don't even accept that, my guy. If you join that, you will be uh uh, uh promoted to the Keisha Academy block list. How do you love yourself? Can you give advice? Uh, listen. You got to understand what you don't like about yourself and how you can change it. But you also have to understand certain uh, parts of who you are that you can't change, right? Focus on what you can control because the more that you waste time um, overthinking and, and, and psyoping your way out of success when it comes to certain, like your height, for example, or maybe certain features like you're not like these things you will literally drive yourself insane because like even look at some celebrities for example zach efron dude everybody looked at troy and gabriella and went absolutely crazy now that's not really what relationships are like but troy and gabriella were like picture perfect zach efron like looked the way he did and he looked fine but as he got more successful people said a lot of things about him even though he looked good to y'all he didn't believe it so whatever they told him he believed and he started changing his face and guess what? The more that you change your face, the more you see, oh, man, I got to change this. I got to change that. You start literally trying to forcefully change things that you're not supposed to be able to control. And it leads you down a road of just endless misery and sorrow. You have to be able to focus on what you can control and what you can't. You got to learn how to love yourself. Accept your past for what it is and have a better future. You don't got to try to bring anybody else down. So what? They did you how they did you. Use that as your wisdom to be able to be better and to motivate other people. I don't sit back crying about what happened back in the day because I'm living today. The present is a present, but a lot of people don't see it as a gift, homie. Let me keep speaking, though. Let them cook. Yeah, I'm cooking, man. A hundred. Yeah. <laughs> Close. Yeah, you got to go, homie. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. You got to go. Yeah. And have a better profile picture than that. Keeping it clean, you know? Are you Christian? Uh, listen, I know this is a typical response now, so I don't even like saying it because everybody says it nowadays, but I don't do religion. I believe religion is a form of division. I believe it's a societal construct to keep people against each other. I have a spiritual relationship with God. I believe in Jesus Christ and the Most High, but I don't do religion. It seems like another form of... I can't even say what I want to say on this live, but just understand that I believe that it is another... A tool of separation and the people within those congregations are some of the most hypocritical hypocritical individuals that you'll ever meet that's why you shouldn't listen to what exactly homie this yep true acceptance is the key to solving allied problems all problems yeah for sure yeah shadow work facts what's good what's good man 
Yeah, you got to go, buddy. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got to go. Oops, I accidentally unmuted that Keisha. So if they type again, get him out of here. My bad, mods. I know y'all on top of it. <laughs> uh, when I walk into uh, Sound Deep, I like it. Well, welcome. You know what I'm saying? We get into the latter uh, part of this episode, but y'all know me, man. I'm going to keep putting out a good game until I don't know more, you know? But look, man, um, the faith of a mustard seed can take you a long way, but a lot of people say, law of attraction, law of attraction, if I think it, it'll happen. Homie, law of action is more important. Uh, homie, I'm finna remind you of why you shouldn't say, oh, there we go. Oh, get that dude up out of here. There's no way that you're sitting around at 4.30 in the morning telling another man that you love him. Homie, you don't love me. You don't even love yourself. You don't know me. How can you love somebody that you don't know, homie? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. How can you love somebody that you don't know? See, these are the types of guys that get in a relationship have you seen the uh, interview? Yeah, yeah, with Cam. Already nearly a 2 million views. Shout out to Charleston White. A lot of people compare me to him because of the way that I talk, but they don't even know. That's my guy in real life. Yeah, 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 no. So shout out to Charleston White. He be speaking the truth. Shout out to him. But anyways, don't bring up nobody else in my life unless I brought him up. But back to what I was saying, though. Uh, 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 what was I finna say? Man, oh, yeah, yeah, like, man, a lot of you guys be getting in relationships with girls, and uh, y'all ain't even been nowhere outside of a movie theater or walking around in the mall, and then you think you can tell a girl you love her in a week. Uh, you're not going to say it back. Homie, how can you love somebody that you don't know? And, and get that person out of here. You can love anybody, homie. I don't even like people that misspell you. If you don't put in enough effort to spell you properly, I know that you ain't following the word properly, homie. Yeah, 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 yeah. You taking shortcuts to tight words, so I know you taking shortcuts and cherry picking around the scripture. Yeah, yeah, I don't want to hear it. What's good, Hannah? What's good? That part, yeah. Coming up in my chat acting like the main character. Homie, you typing too loud. Shh. <laughs> Here come the Keisha train. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nah, man, it's spectacular. We do it how we do it, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, just being unique in a way that they can't compete, homie. You know what I mean? You typing too loud. Yeah, yeah. Typing way too loud. Get that out of here immediately. That's a whole, that's a guy typing out. Yeah, yeah, what's up, Keisha? I see you. Oh, I see you too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at all of you traveling. I can see you. You said, I hope you had a good day yesterday. I hope you did as well, you know? Um, as far as progress goes, not even necessarily progress, but the, the motivation, this is why I tell you guys that you cannot let motivation be your source for energy because sometimes you will plateau whenever you have new high scores in life, whether it comes to your workload or maybe your focus or your, uh, spending habits, whatever the case may be, whenever you do something and in not abnormal, but a higher level than normal, you have to understand it's a lot like when you go to the gym and you have DOMS, which is delayed onset muscle soreness, right? So whenever you work out your muscle to a level that hasn't been worked out before, you're going to plateau shortly after because that's your body's way of getting used to it. So a lot of you are on the new way. You're on a new journey of doing a particular thing and you feel like, oh, I'm not getting anywhere. Keep doing it. That is your mind trying to psyop you out of enduring. Endurance is what will help you complete marathons. When speed is no longer applicable due to your stamina, you will always be able to keep jogging, but you won't always necessarily be able to continue sprinting. Whenever I was in high school and I did track and I played football, I always liked sprinting. But whenever I ran out of stamina, I couldn't keep up with the joggers anymore. So when you're doing a marathon, which is what life is, there's no use of being in a uh, 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 spectacular sprinter because your stamina is only going to last for so long when you're going at that speed. So you have to understand that you have to pace yourself and you have to keep going through the highs and the lows because it's all about balance type stuff, type stuff. I'm going to hit the gym today. That's what I like to hear. Slow and steady wins the race. Exactly. So that's the reason why I sit back and I tell people, man, stop going to social media because it gives you uh, the fear of missing out, right? It gives you the fear of missing out. Oh, they're going there, so I got to go there. Oh, they're wearing these shoes, so I got to stop thinking you got to do something just because someone else is doing it. Um, your life is your life. 
your purchasing decisions should all be predicated upon what you desire, not what you feel like if you possess, someone will accept you for it. I see a lot of quote unquote relationship coaches saying, buy these clothes, buy this. And homie, if you got to deceive somebody into associating with you, that will not be an interaction that is long kept because you attracted them with a certain image. So whenever that image wears off and you are really who, who you are, they're going to go away because they only came to you for what you had, not for who you were, because it was on you, not in you. Yeah, 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 no, nah, because it was on you and not in you. I can put on any type of clothes. I can wear any type of shoes. And people are going to be like, where you get that from? Because I just got that style, homie. Uh, anywhere that I go, the ladies look at me. Anywhere that I go, the guys say they respect me. They like this and they like that. It's because I stand out. A lot of y'all blend in, homie. And the more that you blend in, you ain't going to be able to make say, man, if the blender never stops, the smoothie ain't going to be made. I'm not blending no more. I'm outside the box. They always want to try to put you in a box. Sometimes it'll be family members. Sometimes it'll be longtime friends. Man, sometimes your pets will start randomly acting up. Hey, man, say, man, we all go through seasons, but understand that, man, people change, man. Get that person out of here, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, you worried about where I'm at. Quit worrying about my worry. About, that's something that you shouldn't care about. Sitting around at 4.30 in the morning asking me where I live. Uh, rent free inside of your head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sitting around at 4.30 asking me where I live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, rent free inside of your head. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rent free. <laughs> Man, it's crazy, bro. So look, though, uh, we getting ready to wrap this episode up. So make sure each and every single one of you send me a message immediately on TikTok. I will be checking my request right now. And everybody who does so, I will send my Snapchat. That's the best way to talk to me. No one I'm going live next and to stay up to date with the content. I want to thank my chat. You guys were absolutely amazing uh, just with your responses and just everything that you guys did. And also, shout out to my moderators. You guys are absolutely phenomenal. Thank you for keeping up with the Keisha's. I'd rather have less viewers than more people who just want to be entertained. I'm here to give you perspectives, and I want you to be greater. I want you to be greater than me. But remember, you're only competing with yourself. But if I give you the wisdom, you might be at a different point in your life to where you can be further than me if you apply it. That's what it's about. It's not about getting all the game and keeping it to yourself. You got to let your friends borrow the game so they can complete it too. That's what life's about. So I'm not selfish, homie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this ain't for a currency. Because it occurred to me that a lot of people need to hear the truth because there's a lot of fake being put out there. So with that being said, man, we stand on business. Get that key shape out of my chat. We're going to keep doing what we do while they do nothing. Peace.